you're looking to sculpt a perfect body, Eric Fleshman, known in Hollywood as Eric the Trainer, can get you started. To get ready for the red carpet, many times it just means leaning out. I've worked with Ethan Suplee from My Name is Earl and helped him lose weight. I've worked with Juliette Lewis and Kirstie Alley. I've worked with Mark DiCarlo. I've worked with Jason Doring from Veronica Mars. I've had a great time working with celebrities and normal people too. Many celebrities find themselves in shape and yet on camera they still look a little big and so when they need to lean out a little bit we usually change their diet and their exercise program. Many of the celebrities that I do work with always say to me before the red carpet season, okay we have two weeks, let's really make this happen. These next exercises are part of my Sleeping Beauty program for women. Many women don't realize that the time that your body changes, the actual time that it makes the changes is while you sleep. Now, if you're looking to change your body and look like Juliette Lewis or Marissa Ribisi, this is the way that we got them looking so great. Five, one, two. We are building the perfect Hollywood body right before your eyes. Woohoo! Now, when it came time to tone Jennifer Aspen's gluteus maximus, we used our secret weapon, the hydrant. Let's demonstrate now. Half and three, beautiful. Half and four, half, five, very nice form. With the Sleeping Giant program, upper body cardiovascular movement is an important quotient. This is called Kali, and it helped Ethan Suplee from My Name is Earl lose over 200 pounds. Charlie's gonna demonstrate this ancient Filipino art. When it came time to build Jason Doring from Veronica Mars' chest and make it broad and wide, we actually used the bench press. The wider the hands, the wider the chest. You'll notice as he takes it off, the elbows will come out to the side. Good coming down, big expansion touch and explode up. Fantastic. Wayne Brady is known for his strong sculpted arms. And to make those arms, we have a special exercise. And coming up, elbows in front and twist, squeeze, hold tight, 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 and coming down. That's two, look at those arms grow. Woohoo! Woohoo! There are those Hollywood arms. The motivation for celebrities is very, very different because they're pulled in many different directions. And so my motivational skills have to be very honed and on full blast when I work with celebrities. When working with Mark DiCarlo, host of Taste of America, it's important to make his abdominals as lean as possible because he finds himself eating food the whole time on the show. We use a method called Chase the Rabbit. Two, three, three. Two, three, four, good. This works the abdominal, this works the cardiovascular system, and it also strengthens the upper body. Now I'd love to say that Mark loves this exercise, but he actually hates it. However, it works, so it's part of our Hollywood workout. You don't have to be a celebrity or live in Hollywood to work out like this. Eric created Fit Call. I developed a way to talk them through a workout wherever they were in the world that they could access through their computer or their telephone. All they had to do was go to my website, which is www.ericthetrainer.com. It's the same Hollywood workout that we have here in California, only it's in your bedroom or hotel room.